At least four people are dead, nine others injured after a pedestrian bridge collapses onto a road in Sweetwater, Florida. Right now, search and rescue crews are still looking for victims, possibly trapped in that rubble. Laura Podesta has more on this tragedy for WJZ. On Thursday afternoon, Southwest 8th Street in Sweetwater, Florida turned into a disaster zone. The uh, whole bridge is down across the whole side of 8th Street. Shortly before 2 p.m., a pedestrian bridge being built next to Florida International University collapsed. 950 tons of steel and concrete came crashing down onto eight vehicles stopped at a red light beneath it. There's car stuff under there. Within minutes, a massive search and rescue effort was underway. I jumped out of my car, I locked my car, and I ran towards the victims to see if we could help anybody. But when I saw, the only thing you could see were, were the car lights in the front. It's totally smashed, almost to the ground. First responders used dogs and listening devices to look for survivors. Cranes and other heavy equipment were brought in to stabilize the debris. The bridge was still under construction and had not yet opened to the public. Time lapse video shows how it was assembled next to the road before being swung over it on Saturday. Five days ago, we were celebrating that it was in the process of being erected. This bridge was about goodness, not sadness. The National Transportation Safety Board has dispatched a team to the site of the collapse. The agency says its investigation will look at whether the bridge's design played a role in the tragedy. Laura Podesta reporting for WJZ. And fire officials say they have located four victims underneath the bridge but have not yet been able to reach them to recover their bodies.